mari brothers and sisters when we speak about rejection those of you who have gone through rejection there is we will we may cultivate a kind of problem called escapism escapism some people show their escapism by falling into overeating overeating or over sleeping over watching over indulged in sexual perversions so by doing so they are trying to escape from facing the realities of life some people get addicted to drinking and smoking and pornography and all the other things and you don't feel like con- connecting to your family members you don't feel like mo- any more loving your parents or loving your family members because you feel rejected you feel lonely and you feel like escaping from facing the realities of life ultimately you are loo- you are losing your life when you do and encourage this face escapism but our god is there he is ready to exper- to sympathize with you because he was rejected by his own beloved ones he lost his father and he left his home his own hometown his his villagers did not accept him his leaders did not accept him sadhusees pharisees none of them accepted him all those who received healing through him they all rejected him even his beloved ones they all abandoned him and ran away even leaving their clothes behind and then he was crucified on mount calvary not even one person supported him but he did not escape he did not escape from facing the realities of his life that is crucifixion he said i'm supposed to carry this cross this is the cup of sorrow given by my father i have to accept it this cup of sorrow i accept it from the hands of my father he never went for escapism my dear brothers and sisters if you have fallen into escapism and entered into these kinds of bad habits that's a clear sign that you are a loser and you have lost and the battle you have lost the battle therefore come out of this escapism let us face the realities of our life maybe it may be a sore and disturbing reality but don't worry you're not alone in facing this reality you're not alone in this battle against evil your god is there starting standing next to you your god will fight for you he will help you let us read this word of god psalm 94 verse 14 psalm 94 verse 14 let us repeat this word of god for the lord will not forsake his people for the lord will not forsake his people he will not abandon his heritage he will not abandon his heritage for the lord will not forsake his people for the lord will not forsake his people he will not abandon his heritage he will not abandon his heritage for the lord will not forsake his people for the lord will not forsake his people he will not abandon his heritage he will not abandon his heritage let's read 118 verse 22 Psalm 118 verse 22 we read like this The stone that builders rejected the stone that the builders rejected has become the chief cornerstone has become the chief cornerstone Sometimes you feel you are rejected you nobody wants no one cares if you are ready to fight with the Lord you will become the chief cornerstone you will be the most important person and you, the Lord will use you powerfully and that is why this word of god repeat after me the stone that builders rejected the stone that the builders rejected has become the chief cornerstone has become the chief cornerstone the stone that the builders rejected the stone that the builders rejected has become the chief cornerstone has become the chief cornerstone 